and welcome to my first ever unboxing video. In January this year, I ordered Meta's new series, The Camellia Cat Hide and Seek. I ordered the Unlined OP, and it arrived as scheduled in early July, but because I'm me, I'm now filming this in late July, you'll probably see it in August, and this little guy has been sitting in my Lolita room for weeks, and I'm finally getting to see what's inside. All I've done so far is cut open the top, and that's all I've been able to see for weeks, just for you guys. So, let's get into it. Oh boy. <laughs> oh man, I'm actually, I'm really like nervous excited because I've never done an unboxing before, and I'm also really keen for this dress. All right, so let's just pull out the first thing. First thing being a meta paper bag. That's very cute, but uh, you know, not the not the main event. So let's just get that out of the way. All right. Ooh, ooh, it's cute. Okay, but there's a couple of papers in the bag. I'm gonna get the papers out first. Oh, cool! Another meta sticker and like just a little generic letter. That's fine. As you can see, I used a previous meta sticker to cover up my address on the box, but the box is now empty. So let's do it! Oh my gosh! Oh wow, it's so pretty already. The texture on this fabric is amazing. And as I predicted, part of the reason why I love this is because the dumbass cat on this looks pretty much like our dumbass cat. Okay. Yep, gonna stop talking. Let's go. Very plastic. Oh, ooh, oh, okay. The fabric actually feels super delightful too. That sort of honeycomb texture. I'll show it to you properly. Let's see if the camera can focus on this. Not, not really, it wants to focus on my face. But I don't know if you can see that sort of honeycomb texture. It's absolutely delightful. But all right, let's let's unfold this beauty. Ooh. Ooh. Oh yeah. Oh, so pretty. Oh man. Oh wow. Oh, this is oh. This is gorgeous. I'm gonna stop talking for a minute because at this point in the video I will insert some delightful close-ups taken on my mannequin while I in person just go because it is so cute. This has a lot of detachable pieces. These cute little bows with the tassels at the top, those are detachable. The crisscross ribbon neckties, also detachable. They do up with a button on the inside. And then this big waist bow, also detachable. I'm probably gonna actually wear that as a head bow or something a lot because I didn't order the matching head bow because, well, this was stretching the budget as it is. I don't tend to buy a brand new brand and I just wasn't you know, spring for the matching headwear, but it's absolutely gorgeous and what's so nice is it's immediately evident because I ordered the plus size, um, which is the middle of the three sizes, there's regular plus size and plus plus size, and this is the plus side and just looking at it, it is definitely a much larger piece and then it's still got a very generous showing panel at the back, the shoulders are elasticized, the sleeves are elasticized and this just looks like it's going to be a really ridiculously comfortable dress and I am I'm so down for comfortable related dresses. Life's too short to be uncomfortable. You may as well just wear something that is adorable and also comfortable. I can't get over how nice this is and of course forgot to mention the waist ties are also detachable. Oh man okay this is beautiful I've shown it to you, and now I've got to try it on. As you can see, the dress is 
absolutely adorable. It is a perfect and comfortable fit. I will flash up my current measurements versus the advertised measurements, just for reference sake. But oh, it is beautiful, it is comfortable, it is light, but it feels sturdy. I absolutely love it. And the best thing is, obviously when they graded it up for plus sizes, they did factor in larger busts as well, because this underbust line actually fits perfectly at my underbust rather than sort of riding up to mid-boob. It is absolutely fantastic, and I am going to go and see what my husband thinks of it. Well, actually, no. I'm gonna go get my husband to come in here and tell you what he thinks of it. All right, everybody, we are gonna reveal the dress to the husband in three, two, one. Oh, <laughs> so cute. Isn't it just? It's really cute. Yeah. Oh, you're stepping out of camera right now. Oh, sorry. I'm just taking it all in. Yeah. Oh, isn't it, isn't it cute? It's... And this comes off, and these come off, and it that's does a really have nice a... I like how that's sort of like a tie at the end, it has little tassels. It does have a neck thingy, but I didn't put that on because that's too much effort. <laughs> and, so cute, though. And, and, and look at my waist ties, they have the little tassels too. And What a nice touch. Doesn't the, the little cat, doesn't the little dum-dum cat look like Panda? Exactly like Panda. I yeah. told you it looks like a yeah. cat. Oh man. Hmm. However, I do have an idea. Ooh, Shazam. Shazam indeed, I like it, you look cute. It really is a beautiful dress, folks, and he really is a beautiful husband. I hope you enjoyed watching this unboxing video, and until next time, bye-bye. Bye. -bye. bye.